<laughs> I was like, who is that? <laughs> Nothing. I'll tell you later. My friends are watching me vlog. Anyway. What's up guys? It's day three of New Orleans and today I'm excited because it's gonna be a very chill and relaxed day of just enjoying the French Quarter. Before we get into this video, if you're new to my channel, please make sure to subscribe down below. I really appreciate your support. And with that said, let's get into this vlog. So we found brunch at this restaurant called Dickie Brennan's, which is right on Jackson Square. And the reason I'm shouting right now is because there's a jazz band playing right behind me. It's definitely very hot up here, but it's definitely worth the scenery and the view. And guys, let me show you this view. This view is absolutely incredible. So one of the best things about New Orleans is they have plenty of shops and little gems around the city that are completely and totally free. So my friends and I visited a lot of voodoo stores and voodoo is a big thing down in New Orleans and it's a religion that a lot of people still practice. One of my favorite free stops is definitely Bovolos Gas Lamps. They are a store in New Orleans that hand makes all the copper gas lamps that you'll see hanging across the city and they're one of the oldest manufacturers. And of course it isn't a trip to New Orleans if you don't stop by Pat O'Brien's for their famous hurricane. This was one of my favorite drinks and I absolutely loved our stop here. And of course we had to have shrimp and grits as well as some jazz. It's day four of our trip. I can't believe that it's our last full day here in New Orleans So um, we're gonna be going to the French market to do some shopping and to also try some of the pop-up Food stands and then after that we're just gonna do some souvenir shopping and do a little bit more wandering throughout New Orleans I think today's gonna be like yesterday where it was a little bit more chill last day <laughs> market and there are so many different stands where you can shop and try different types of local cuisine. Right now my friends and I are at stand 25 which is the seafood dock and they offer so many different options from fried soft shell crab to shrimp tacos but we decided that we're gonna get a dozen of the raw oysters which I'm so excited about. Where are you from beautiful? I'm from New York we don't get to shop. New York oysters. City! Yeah I'm a city girl. What you know about oysters? Nothing, that's why I need you to let me shuck one. Wow. Okay, maybe you could like hammer one and then I could just do the twisting. How does that sound? Come on. I can't hurt myself that way. See, look, I can do that part. I can do that part. <laughs> I've seen it done before. I feel like I could do it. Maybe if you have like an easy one, I could just quickly shuck it. <laughs> you know what would make me the super bad mother shark if I could pick up an oyster say it's gonna be easy. No, like one that's like kind of open, like you know. You know, you don't want that one. If it's kind of <laughs> open, that means it's. Oh, that's, that's true. Easy. That's true. It's like stunning, guys. Amazing. These are massive. What do you mean my dad's no alcohol? That seems like a really bad idea, so I'm gonna scoop some of that off. The lemon is my favorite part. The French market was definitely a highlight for me on this trip, mainly because there were all these small dishes that you could get to try a bunch of different types of food. We paid $6 for this plate of soft shell crab and it was really affordable and a great snack. I was definitely surprised by how easy it was to eat the crab, especially since it was fried whole with the entire shell still on, but it was well seasoned and super, super yummy. 
After you visit the French Market, make sure to stop by Southern Candy Makers. We love this shop because they have amazing pralines and they make for a great gift. And that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching the latest video on my YouTube channel, Catch Up With Cassie. If you like what you saw, make sure to subscribe down below. I really, really appreciate it. And until the next video, I'll see you in the next one.